Welcome everyone, in this video we are going to show that 8 is equal to negative 8. Of course, this is not a correct statement, so while we show this, there will be a mistake somewhere. And your job is to figure out where that mistake is. Alright, so let's get started. I will write negative 8 and then I'm going to say this is equal to negative 2 cubed. Alright, because if we multiply negative 2 by negative 2, we get 4. And then we multiply it by negative 2 again, we get negative 8. This is going to be equal to negative 2 raised to the power of 2. And then all of this raised to the power of 3 over 2. Here I am just using the fact that a raised to the power of b and then raised to the power of c is just equal to a raised to the power of b times c. I use this property, okay? Now, continuing from this, let's, uh, let's simplify the first parentheses. That is going to be negative 2 squared. That is simply negative 2 times negative 2, which is 4. And it is, it is raised to the power of 3 over 2. Here, we know that 4 is just 2 raised to the power of 2, and then we raise it to the power of 3 over 2. So if we use this property that I just mentioned, this is going to be 2 raised to the power of 3 over 2 times 2, which is 2 raised to the power of 3. That is just 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8. And look at this. On the left, we have negative 8. And on the right, we have 8. So we showed that 8 is equal to negative 8 then where is the mistake? That's your job to find. And if you find it, write that in the comment section. Anyways, I hope to see you in another video. Until then, take care.